All right, here we are today at Ripple Bee Farms. We're going to be putting a swarm in a box. Right now we're just going to get the fire going. And the smoke. Okay. Start by kind of getting the bees calm down. For a crow. So let me put on my gear and we'll start immediately. All right. So, as you can see, we've got a Italian swarm we're working with today. We're going to start by getting this here. Top off. And we will get everything prepped out. Move one frame and leave room for our queen cell. Boom, boom, boom. That's rocking and that's rolling. So, one more time, we'll give them a little smoke, keep them nice and calm. Find my hive tool. And we'll just start by prying that little box open. First, let me find my the gummy bear so that just makes life a little easier. There it is. That's what we're going to use to cap our queen cell. So you're going to see some bees moving around here. As you can see, we've got some happy Italian honeybees. Okay, the, the can's trying to drop down. Let's try to prevent that from happening. There we go. So, we'll take their food cap. Slowly pull that out of there. And we'll find a location for that. So they could still eat off of it. We'll just kind of give them so they can come up to the bottom because the bottom has holes in it and there's still some nectar in there so they'll probably want to use that. We'll get them ready for that. We'll get our queen. First thing we always do is make sure she's in there. Shake all the bees out of the way. As you can see, the queen is in there. She's marked with a little spot to make sure she's the queen. And we're not trying to stress her, but we do want to get some of the bees out of the way. So here we'll make sure she's pointing down before we take her cork out. And we'll put a gummy bear in the place of the cork so that they take a day or two to chew to her instead of her being surrounded immediately sometimes they can get suffocated you don't want that okay as you can see she's about ready to go back down and so I'm going to wait for that and then cap it with my finger wait till she goes back down one more time and cap it with the gummy bear and we'll make sure that gummy bear is nice and in there because sometimes gravity will make it fall out when you hang the the queen kind of give it a nice hook there so that you can hook and not everybody's come like this but ours in this local area in Oregon do they're gonna have to chew through that to get to her she's still in there and we're gonna put the queen right there and kind of keep her level with everything centered centered and level and now comes the part that some of you might think looks a little mm -hmm. violent, but it's just the fastest way to get your your 10,000 bees or whatever we got in here in there as fast as possible. And let's just go ahead and do that. So, I'm gonna start by showing you our little friends. Hey, everybody, love you. Take care of your queen, thank you. 
And here's the part that is going to be quick and painless for everybody, but we do have to do it. And as you can see, I'm just trying to get it done. Ooh, looks like they made a, a little comb in there already. They've been busy. We'll give them that in case they want to work with it. And there's another ball of bees. We got a, quite a bit in this swarm. So we'll leave this here. Just so that they can go. We'll kind of brush everybody in with Mama Queen. Sorry guys, love you. Beautiful, beautiful. Oh, the smell of fresh honeybees. They have a certain insect smell that's so pleasant because of the honey they create. It's so incredible. Cap that temporarily just to kind of keep it and maybe if they want to come up a little bit through there that's fine and then we're gonna move everybody out of the way and we will call that a day and so another good day here at ripple bee farms and we want to thank everybody for joining today really appreciate it we believe in sustainability organics and doing everything the original way. We believe in the bee, and we would like to help save the bee, and that's why we beekeep. The honey just comes as a bonus. Hey guys, thanks for watching the video. I really appreciate it. If you could hit a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel, I'll be putting out more videos soon, and I hope you have a great day. Thanks so much.